Hello, Jim, Tuesday, video, not much time, crack on, straight away. Osric Tentacles, Epiphlioi. I think I say so. Um, Osric is a band I've uh, known and followed for a very, very, very long time. Um, I've listened to a lot of their music. But seeing as it's a band whose career thus far has spawned more than 30 albums, um, it's not surprising I haven't heard all of it. And this is one of those examples. And this is from a fairly new album, Technicians of the Sacred is the album. And this is recommended by Oliver... Uh, Oliver Kossoff, who um, has recommended quite a few things from uh, for me over the over the months that I've been doing this. Uh, so Oliver Kossoff, thank you very much. Um, it's always good to hear from you as well. And um, yes, we both listen to a lot of Osrix, but he's listened to more than me, I think. So this is uh, this is one to one to put that right. So again, as I say, I don't know this track. Um, if you have listen to the other videos I've done of Roderick's on here, you'll know kind of what it's about and uh, or what sort of music it is. It's probably, I'm almost 100% certain this is going to be instrumental uh, because that's what they are. They're an instrumental space rock prog band. Um, uh, quite trippy, quite uh, bits of Hawkwind, bit Tangerine Dream, bit... Um, uh, Pink Floyd y vibes in places. Um, really, really, I love this band. I love this band a lot. And uh, so let's hope this is going to be good. It's quite long. Uh, 11 and a half minutes. Oh, no. 11.50, 12 minutes, just about. So let's see where this goes, shall we? I shall see you guys on the other side. Three, two, one. Ostrix. <laughs> Awesome. bubbly synth sound is a very, very common sound that they use in a lot of their tracks. What a riff!
love how that bass line is following the riff now. make one piece of music built around one riff that goes on for so long but keeps being interesting. So many layers, so much colour. do use vocal. It's just for texture.
I love that. Middle Eastern vibe going on here. What a trip! That was a journey. Oh bloody hell! Uh, that was twelve minutes. Um, that didn't seem like twelve minutes. That was over in a flash. Uh, absolutely classic Osric tentacles. Um, it's so so familiar, but new at the same time. Uh, and it threw everything in there that they are good at the amazing uh, sort of uh, dubby bass lines and the intricate drumming uh, without being sort of too metal about it incredible riff which was repeated over and over and over again and then just layer upon layer upon layer of beautiful pads and sequenced um, analog synths um, so they use a lot of the Roland uh, Jupiters and Junos and stuff and get this gorgeous, gorgeous sound. You can, you can hear it in, all the way through that. And uh, it's just, just phenomenal. Absolutely love that. Absolutely love it. Um, I didn't expect I wouldn't um, because there is precious little that I've heard them do that I don't like. So... Um, I didn't expect I was going to have any problem with it at all. So it is very good. However, uh, whether you did or not is uh, entirely up to you, <laughs> of course. Um, as I said earlier on, sorry, I haven't really got a lot of time tonight, so I'm not going to be able to sort of pad this out much at the end with uh, sort of much in the way of uh, analysis or picking it apart and sort of talking about the different parts. What I will say is it's good not to have any lyrics on there, so I don't have to try and understand what it's about. It's just about being amazing music and being able to transport you to uh, absolutely is it transports you to another world you just close your eyes and because there's no underlying message about what it's trying to say or portray it means to you what it means to you and it just is gives you headspace and what i would say is if you didn't listen to this in headphones listen to this on the best headphones you possibly can because the detail and the amount of stuff that's going on in there is amazing and you will listen to that well no you may not but I will you'll listen to it again and again and again and again and I think every time you listen to it you may hear a little additional nuance something you haven't heard before it will suddenly come out to you and you'll 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 hear it for the for the first time <sighs> Oliver, thank you very much. Uh, excellent recommendation, as ever. Um, I'll get back to you guys soon, hopefully. Uh, whenever and whatever that is going to be. So until then, this is Jim Over and out. <laughs>